Hey besties, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jada Simone and you're watching Jada's channel. I don't love just anyone. I am not just anyone. I rock heels, I rock Jordans. And I wear wigs and rock my natural. Can you believe it says I'm pretty but with dark skin? Happy New Year, besties. It is 2023. It is officially January. It is officially the new year and I'm feeling great. <laughs> A little anxious, but definitely great. Definitely feeling very blessed. Honestly, 2022 was filled with a lot of blessings. I was blessed with new career opportunities, greater income. I hit different milestones on YouTube. I hit 2k, I hit 3k and I'm continuing to grow. I went viral on TikTok. I moved into my first apartment. So many great things happened. God definitely showed out for your girl. When I tell y'all like the things that have happened in this past year were beyond my wildest like dreams, wildest imagines, honestly. So this past week and weekend my boyfriend was over and we were going over like goals and stuff and I have wrote down my 2022 goals in my notes app on my phone but I, I literally wrote them down back in January and never revisited them so like you know it was coming up on the new year so I pulled up that same note and I want to say it was about 10 things on my goals list and out of those 10 things I had only accomplished two things one of them being moving into my first apartment by myself and like you know that was amazing and then another goal was a very like personal goal for me and my boyfriend but just to think even though I didn't accomplish all 10 of those goals things did happen and I did put things in motion to be able to accomplish the goals in the future and then I wrote down some more goals for 2023 so it's only going up from here 2023 was definitely full of a lot of blessings and a lot of lessons I I don't want to say like I lost friends or anything but like you know God definitely removed people from my life that weren't meant to be in my life who no longer served me or who probably never served me to begin with or I just stopped being convenient and serving them so a lot of people well i don't want to say a lot of people but a few people did not come into 2023 with me i'm just gonna be honest <laughs> and like you know it's no love lost it just is what it is i'm closing that chapter and opening this new chapter in my life and you know certain things and certain people may not align and that's you know it's, it's never nothing to be sad about or dwell on it's just all in the name of growth <laughs> But this vlog is going to be me prepping for the new year. I definitely want to be a lot more consistent on my YouTube channel. This is something that I've been struggling with for the longest. And back in May, my boyfriend like sat me down and he was like, what is like hindering you from being consistent and being the content creator that you want to be in life? I was like, honestly, I'm what's hindering me. Like, you know, I do have a little bit of anxiety and sometimes I do suffer with it when I'm thinking and planning my content. And when it comes time to to execute the content i get a little anxious because it might not turn out the way i want it to turn out but for 2023 i'm doing everything scared it does not matter if the content is not going to come out the way i want it to because to be honest sometimes when i'm feeling anxious about filming content when i actually just go ahead and do it it comes out way better than i could have even imagined the content coming out so yeah we're just gonna do it scared we're going to do it blind we're just gonna have faith and let god lead the way and i'm going to be a lot more consistent because nine to five corporate life is not it from your girl i love producing content for you guys and this is definitely like what i was meant to do <laughs> but as y'all can see there's still like christmas decor and shout out to my mother she did my cabinet so they look like little presents super cute but it is time to put away all the christmas decor and put it in my storage unit <laughs> I'm so sad. I love Christmas. But like literally for the Christmas season, it seems like you're preparing for Christmas for like the whole month. It happens in one day and then the next day it's like, okay, it's time to pack everything up. So it's time to pack everything up and we're going to start decorating for February and like, you know, the new year, just prepping and cleaning and all that good stuff. So yeah, besties, I'm about to start packing this stuff up and I will pick the camera back up when I'm done. <laughs> Boy, shout it, yeah, do it. Rock the beat for your boy. Radio killer, killer. Shout it, clap it, shout it, type 
it, shoes great it, all night it Now it's time I hit, get back up with you Girl, with you Oh yeah, we used to kick it up at the park But now she's all grown up Rockin' them stilettos, jumpin' the bottle That Mercedes truck Ooh, it was Keisha It was Sonya It was Sonya It was Sonya It was easy It was easy hey, Now to see you at 23, all I can say is besties i'm back and i'm exhausted it is currently 2 30 on the dot in the morning i'm exhausted i'm hot but all of the christmas stuff is all packed away the tree is naked i gotta figure out when and how i'm about to take this tree out to go to the garbage because i did get a real tree um but it gotta go <laughs> it's time to decorate for valentine's day so um, my wagon is all packed up with all of the christmas decor we're gonna go to my storage unit tomorrow and get and swap out the christmas decor for the valentine's day decor it's not a lot honestly i was debating on if i wanted to do some shopping for some more valentine's day decor because i think i'm gonna host galentine's day but i don't know if i'm gonna do more shopping I don't know. I don't need to spend no more money, y'all. But anyway, that is all for tonight. I'm about to shower, get comfortable, and go to bed. Well, wait for my boyfriend to call me and go to bed. So I just... <laughs> this prepping for the new year is a lot. But besties, I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Now, y'all. Hey, bestie boos. It is Saturday, and we cleaned up last night. Well, we didn't clean up. We packed away the christmas ornaments we still gotta clean up this house but i'm headed to my storage unit to drop the christmas stuff off and pick up some valentine's day stuff i think it's only one bag so we're about to go do that and then come back and get this house together because it it needs a little tlc it needs a deep clean all that good stuff so yeah let's go besties <laughs> besties happy sunday so we are out running our sunday errands still prepping for the new year first stop is dollar tree i have to get cleaning supplies because y'all know it's definitely cheaper than going to walmart or any other place to get cleaning supplies then we are going to clean this car out and then hit walmart to grocery shop so let's go wow wow yeah look at me dead in my eyes i know that you know that a nigga ain't lying too much respect, all of my shorty BDs, they know not to try Too much respect, I used to hand out CDs before they would buy Whoa, she love me so much, it seems like she vibes Niggas don't know how I live, but that's cause they live at the high hey. Four L steps, he ain't stepping on shit to the spot He brought me the money set up, I still had to count it, I cannot just hide all right besties i am back home with my cart full of groceries <laughs> and my new pillows i'm exhausted like i left the house at 11 30 and it is 3 20. 
and I only had three stops. It was the Walmart that did it. It really was, but I'm so happy. When I walked in just now, I was like, my apartment is so clean. Like, I cleaned the heck out of this apartment. Like, it's so clean, it look empty. And y'all know, like, I have a fully furnished apartment. But we are about to disinfect these groceries, put them away, and then I'm gonna throw those pillows into the washing machine because if you buy pillows from the store and don't wash them before putting them on your bed and putting your face on the pillow, that's nasty. I just, you know, I'm just here to tell you that it's disgusting. So I'm about to go put all my pillows in the washing machine. I'll probably only be able to do like two at a time. But that is a okay with me um and then i have to wash all my sheets but yeah guys um that's what i'll be doing so just watch me cue the b-roll besties so i finished doing all of my like little chores um i'm just waiting on one more load to dry in the dryer and that's just my duvet cover and the matching pillowcases and i think my body pillowcase cover i don't know but i cooked and i did everything i was supposed to do so i work tomorrow so i'm thinking about doing a little self-care y'all know how i feel about working in my job so i need to like decompress before i have to go in there and like pretend that i really like these people and i really care about what's going on so let's do a bubble bath <laughs>